Hello everyone, this is Apriyansu Chopra, Assistant Professor of Suresh Bihan Yaha University. Today we will talk about a soil sampling uh, and testing method. Uh, according to this uh, topic, we, uh, uh, we will discuss about the depth of sampling and soil sampling process and sampling tools, um, precautions uh, and collections and storage of samples and uh, um, and uh, uh, labeling, uh, labeling of samples, information uh, sheets, uh, registration of sample in a laboratory, and uh, drying and sieving uh, of a soil sampling uh, of uh, analysis. So let's see. Uh, soil analysis data are uh, used uh, in a uh, many field like uh, uh, construction of uh, roads and building, uh, survey and mapping and uh, use planning, etc. On the other hand, the soil testing is uh, considered uh, as a useful tool for uh, making fertilizer recommend, uh, recommendations for a uh, various crop and uh, cropping. Mm, sequence as well as for reclamations of a problem soil. The major objective of soil testing are first one is soil fertility evolution for making fertilizer simulations for a specific field and farming situation. Uh, second one is the prediction of a likely crop response to applied uh, nutrient classification of soil uh, into different fertility groups for uh, preparing soil fertility map uh, of a given area and uh, assessment of the type uh, and the degree of soil related problems like uh, salinity, sodicity, acidity etc so uh, and uh, suggesting uh, appropriate determination and amelioration uh, measurements only uh, a small friction of uh, the total nutrient in uh, soil is actually available to plants uh, uh, at a uh, given time uh, this uh, available friction in soil is uh, highly dynamic in nutrient uh, in nature. It is uh, equilibrium with uh, certain uh, uh, other forms, therefore uh, reliable uh, index of uh, soil fertility and determined uh, through a soil testing for a better understanding as well to uh, make sound rec uh, rec uh, recommendation soil texture is also considered as an important parameter as it the, um, has a <coughs> bearing on uh, many uh, characteristics of uh, soil influencing uh, response to added nutrients and uh, yeah, amend amendments uh, the success of uh, soil testing depends uh, uh, among uh, other things uh, on the methodology adopted and the interpretation um, of test results. A suitable um, method uh, is on uh, one which uh, uh, satisfy, uh, satisfies uh, three, uh, three types of criteria. Uh, <coughs> Uh, soil testing is an accepted, uh, acceptably uh, accurate and the rapid soil chemical analysis for assessing available nutrient status for making a fertilizer recommendation. And the major steps in a practical soil testing are a soil sampling, preparation of soil sample, extraction analysis of variable nutrient by an appropriate laboratory method and interpretation of Analysis data. Uh, three types of criteria. It should be a fairly rapid tool you know, that the test results can be obtained in 
uh, reasonably short period. It should give a uh, accurate and uh, re the reproducible uh, result uh, of a given sample with the least joint recurrence during the estimation. It should have uh, high uh, predictability is that a significant uh, relationship of the uh, test value with high crop performance. So, <clears throat> while effort, efforts uh, have been uh, made uh, all over the world to develop a universally um, acceptable uh, method such uh, a single soil test of uh, assessing nutrient available availability in soil uh, of a varying uh, characteristics to yet to be involved. In fact, the uh, soil test uh, method are situations specific in nature. It is beyond the scope of this uh, slide to uh, give or even enlist all the methods suggest from a time to time. So uh, soil sampling and processing, uh, soil sampling is uh, perhaps the most vital step for any analysis since a very small fraction of the huge soil mass of the field is used for analysis, it becomes extremely important to get the truly and representative soil sample form it for collecting uh, a representative soil sample due to consideration must be uh, some uh, points. Soil sample must be too representative of the soil so field or, or uh, the part of the uh, field being attested. The fig, uh, this uh, on this uh, slide figure uh, provides the suggested uh, sampling procedure for a small field and for a large field. So according to pick and uh, misleted uh, misleted in 1967 they. Uh, gave a suggestion uh, how to take a soil sampling for a uh, sample uh, for a small and large field. So, uh, uh, showing one first uh, picture A, uh, random, yeah, it means uh, randomly uh, we will take uh, and uh, we can take a sample and B method for a zigzag method and C is a subsampling uh, or large uh, field. So A and B for uh, a field up to a one, uh, one hectare, uh, one hectare. Yes. A C is a recommended sampling uh, plan for the field is up to 15 to 16 hectare with each spot indicating the site of a Subsampling, so it's uh, uh, this sample method uh, given by a uh, Fink, uh, Fink, uh, Fink is, uh, 1992 and Peck and listed in 1967. So the sample must truly represent the field it belongs to. A field can be uh, treated as a single sampling unit uh, if it uh, appreciably uniform generally an area not uh, exceeding 0 0.5 hectares taken as one sampling unit. Variable uh, variation in uh, slopey, uh, variation in slope, color, texture, crop growth and management practices are the important factor the, uh, that should be taken into account for sampling. Separate sample are required for uh, areas uh, different, differing, uh, differing uh, in this characteristic. Recently, fertilizers plot and burned ch channels and mercy uh, track. Uh, as an area near uh, trees, walls, and composed piles uh, or uh, other uh, non representative location must be carefully avoided during a sampling. 
an area of uh, about 2 uh, 3 meters along all the side of the field should be uh, left in large field a large area may be divided into appropriate number of smaller homogeneous unit for better representation uh next one is soil sampling uh and testing so best time of sampling uh, is before uh, showing or plant planting each sample should have a label describing field identification farmer's name and uh, the ad uh, address previous crop and the crop for which nutrient recommendation is um, short uh, abnormal soil patches areas uh, near a uh, fences and are used for a storing animal manure or crop residues should not be sampled for uh, soil sampling special uh, tools are augers with the core diameter uh, of a uh, one to uh, 2 cm are conventional uh, but small spad can also be used <coughs> in any case uh, a uniform slice of a soil should be uh, taken from uh, top to bottom of the desired sampling depth about uh, 20 cores are taken from the field of uh, one hectare depth of sampling uh, the penetration uh, by a plant root roots in an important consideration uh, in a uh, uh deciding the depth of sampling therefore the following uh, factors uh, may be kept in mind keep it in mind so uh, for uh, cereals vegetables and uh, other seasonal crops uh, the sample should be drawn from uh, uh, 0 to 15 cm is that um, plow layers or a furrow uh, slice for depth uh, Uh, deep uh, ro- uh, rooted co- crops or longer duration crop like a sugar cane or uh, under dry farming condition sample should be collected from a different depth depending on the requirement of a individual uh, situation for a plantation crop for uh, crops uh, or a fruit trees uh, composite uh, sample uh, samples from uh, 0 to 30 and uh, 0 to uh, 30 to 60 and 60 to 19 cm depth should be made up of four and five uh, pits dug in the about 0.5 hectare field for a, sl- a saline and alkaline soil alkali soil and salt crust uh, if visible on the soil surface or a suspected should be a sampled separate uh, separately and uh, the depth uh, of a sampling recorded generally the sample uh, may be drawn up the uh, 15 cm depth from the surface for a uh, testing salinity and alkalinity and acidic soil in case uh, the composite samples are drawn from a profile that uh, uh, exceeding uh, 15 cm for a certain uh follow uh, flowering plants like uh, roses and actual depth uh, of a sampling should be indicated when using a spad uh, the following technique should be adopted make a v shaped and the uh, 15 to 20 cm d- uh, uh, deep and take a 1 cm slice from a smooth side uh, trim side with a sh- uh, sharp uh, blade uh, or a uh, pen knife uh, leaving a 2 cm strip so collect this into the clean uh, bucket take a number of the such sample to make a composite uh, samples so uh, soil sampling procedure uh, for make uh, soil sampling uh, before soil sampling we will discuss the sampling requirement tools so uh, uh, shovel uh, spade and khurpi agar use clean tools sample uh, from the uh, proper depth uh, 
and uh, location uh, place samples in a clean uh, bucket from uh, mixing so in this three pictures it is uh, it is showing here now uh, soil sampling procedure uh, procedure for making a composite samples collect a small uh, portion of a soil up to the desired depth of 0 to 15 cm or more by me of a suitable sampling tools from a 15 to 20 well distributed uh, spots moving a zigzag uh, manner from each individual sampling site after the scrapping scrapping uh, of the surface litter if any without removing soil uh, from uh, field having a standing uh, crop in a row draws samples in a between the rows mix together the soil collected from uh, all the spots within one field uh where uh, uh where to uh, where to uh, roughly by a hand on the clean pieces of uh, cloth or polythene or sheet or a clean cemented blow uh reduce the bulk or about a 5 gram by a quartering process uh spread uh, the entire soil mass divided into a four quarter disc discard to uh, opposite one center remix the remaining two repeated this uh, procedure until about a 5 gram soil is left sampling tools a uh, sample can be drawn within the help of the soil tube and tuber agar and uh, striver strip type of agar and post hole agar kasi fabla spad or khurpi so uh, three types of agar we are using uh, for a uh, um, soil sampling uh, first one is striv type of agar second one is a tube agar and third one is a post hole agar if you don't have a uh, three types of agar so you can use a Uh, other instrument like a uh, spade pabda and khurpi also for sampling of a tooth and the moist soil tube agar spade or a khurpi is an appropriate tools i screw a uh, screw type of agar is a more convenient uh, uh convenient on a hard or a dry soil while uh, while the post hole agar is useful for the sampling excess excess excessively uh, wet uh, wet uh, area like rice field if the spad or khurpi used a v shape uh, shaped cut may be uh, first made up uh, to plow layer vertically depth of 15 cm and about 2 cm uniformly uh, make made up the plow layer thick slice is taken out from the one clean side tube agar attached uh, to a long extension rod is uh, convenient for a sampling from a lower depth of the soft soil there is a step involved in the proper collection of a representative soil sample is uh, filled and uh, their handling now preparation of soil sampling after the sample reaches in the laboratory processing room and has to be dried ground and uh, sorted precaution in collection and storage of sample special care in collection or uh, and uh, handling of the soil samples is required in the order to prevent uh, contamination first when the avoid contact of the sample with chemical fertilizer or uh, manures 
use the stainless steel agar agar insist of a, a, a rusted iron uh, uh, khurpi or kasi for a sampling for a micronutrient analysis do not use bags or a box previously used for a storing fertilizer salt and other chemicals a store should sample in clean preferably new cloth or polythene bags use a glass uh, porcelain uh, or a polythene jar uh, polythene jar for a long duration storage first one uh, a take a spread uh, separate sample from each field also take a sample separately from areas or patches looking at different in color slope texture crop performance second one use appropriate sampling tools a kurpi or tube agar uh, Uh, proves a more a uh, convenient for a sampling from a plow, uh, plow layer third pr procedure is a draw sample from uh, several spots from each field by a uh, moving in a zigzag manner covering the entire areas of the pre prepared composite sample leave from uh, leave some um, margin on uh, all side from uh, fields having a standing crops Uh, collected soil from uh, several spots in a uh, between a uh, rows to prepare a composite uh, composite sample so first one is collecting second uh, one is uh, mixing with quartering quartering or removing the opposite uh, uh, two sides and uh, remixing and remaining to uh, repeat for all this process again collect the uh, soil at one clean place mixer through uh, slowly by a hand uh, spread and make pour a quarter discard the two opposite ones mixy mix and the remaining two quarters repeat the process to reduce the quantity to about a 5 gram transfer the soil to clean bag uh, place one level inside uh, the bag uh, and another uh, paste it outside indicating a sample no name of owner depth of sampling identification marks etc before standing to a soil testing laboratory preparation of soil sample after the sample reaches in on the laboratory of the processing room and has to be uh, dried, dried and ground and sieved drying samples are generally air dried uh, temperature 25 to 35 degree relative humidity 20 to 60% and stored for a certain determination such as ammonia and nitrate nitrogen exchangeable potassium acid exchangeable phosphorus and ferrous iron fresh sample for from the field without any drying are required result for of uh, soil analysis are expressed on the oven dry uh, basis preparation of soil sample she uh, Sieving field moist sample prior to uh, and drying can be made uh, to pass through uh, at a 6 mm sieve uh, about a 4 mash per inch by rubbing with a finger this practice seems of uh, uh, much uh, advantages in a case of heavy uh, soil soil is the right moisture condition can uh condition can even be passed through a 2 mm uh, sh uh shift 
the shiva uh, about uh, 10 masses per inches grinding grinding uh, a roller a rubber pistol pistol grinding uh, a roller uh, rubber pistol in an uh, a gate uh, mortar or uh, uh, motorized uh, uh, grinder uh, are commonly em employed uh, crushing of uh, the gravel and uh, primary sand particles should be avoided uh, for heavy soil it is uh, better to pass this to a uh, 2 mm sever before allowing them to get completely air dried Mixing a sample should be truly mixed by a rolling procedure. Place the dried uh, ground and shaved uh, sample on pieces of a cloth. Grasp up of a opposite corner and then holding one corner down, pull the other corner across the sample. This process should be repeated back in the a reverse direction storing storing store the soil is paper cartoons uh, soil sample box using a polythene bag as a inner leaning label the cartoon properly giving cultivators or experimenters name plot name data date of sampling and any uh, initial extraction Analysis of available nutrient by an appropriate laboratory method before we uh, will see labeling of samples. So, uh, labels the samples properly for identification. A label of uh, um, paper with uh, identification um, marks and other deals should be put inside the sample bag and other another one carrying a same details tied and pasted outside the bag in case the soil sample in uh, sample is wet and label should uh, be written with the lead pencil or a uh, uh, permanent uh, ink marker so before air drying information seed in addition to the location field uh, number name of cultivator and identification marks uh, relevant information about a slope drainage irrigation previous cropping history fertilizer manual uh, used etc must be recorded and uh, sent along with the soil sample. This is very specific requirement of a soil testing service and must be enlisted, uh, uh, must be insisted upon a uh, format of information sheet. Registration of samples in the, in, in the laboratory as soon as the samples arise at the laboratory, these are to be uh, serial, uh, to be serially uh, registered, given uh, uh, the uh, date, identification mark, and other relevant uh, particulars 
furnished in the information sheet the sample register as an important parameter document of the soil cellulose testing laboratory must be kept under safe custody and uh, all and uh, and entries uh, allegedly uh, mad drying and shaving uh, shaving of a soil samples for analysis air dry and soil samples uh, in shade discard and plant residue dues uh gravels and other materials if present crush the soil clouds uh, lightly soil clouds uh, lightly and uh, grind uh, with the help of the wooden pistol and more 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 mortar pass passes the entire quantity through the 2 mm stainless steel sieve in case the gravel contain is substantial record it has percent of the sample weight by weight for certain type of analysis example organic carbon grind the soil further so as to pass is through a 0.2 to 0.5 mm sieve we mix the entire quantity of sieve soil fully before analysis in an information sheet to be sent to the laboratory along with the soil sample some most important uh, information put it on the record so first one identification mark like uh, draw, uh, like a first column is a to uh serial number second one is the identification mark no depth of sampling number of spots sampled area of the field upland or lowland uh, lowland irrigated yes or no previous crop raised information very important when uh, manure and fertilizer applied a uh, last after the tick mark uh, the additional test uh, test requirement for uh, like uh, sulfur zinc copper iron magnesium boron and molybdenum name of the crop uh, for which recommendation is uh, short and after that uh, extraction analysis of available nutrients by an appropriated laboratory method so different ex- ex- extraction used uh, are used to extract the specific available nutrients from the soil in the laboratory like available nitrogen available nitrogen method alkaline parameter method available phosphorus sodium bicarbonate for neutral and alkaline soil bray and cruz extraction number 1 for acid soil available potassium ammonium 
acetate process micronutrient cations zinc copper magnesium iron di uh, diethylene triamine uh, pentaacetic acid adpa boron hot water process molybdenum ginger uh, 3s and ammonium oxy, uh, oxalate of uh, ph3 organic carbon uh, wokley and black method and uh, uh, nitrate nitrate uh, nitrate nitrogen method also and also uh, ammon ammonical nitrogen method and uh, mineralize uh, mineralizable uh, nitrogen method so this picture for soil sampling preparation and extraction method interpretation of soil analysis chart data for micronutrient the result generally classified into categories of supply low medium and high see table below for this categories the nutrient amounts required for an optimal uh, optimal or a st uh, stated yield level or estimated for a micronutrient a uh, critical level is generally used to decide uh, whether uh, an application of that nutrient uh, is needed available nutrient nitrogen low kg per hectare uh, less than 280 and medium 280 to 560 and the high is 560 to uh, more phosphorus uh, low less than 10 and medium uh, 10 to 24.6 and high is uh, uh, more than 24.6 potassium uh, low 108 less than 108 and medium 108 to 280 and high uh, more than 280 for nutrient uh, other uh, for nutrients other than npk a single critical level is usually uh, designated below which a soil is considered to be a deficient deficient in the nutrient hence requiring uh, its application general soil test limits used for a classifying soil into a different fertility classes then if i lower Uh, following a table so nitrogen percentage in organic carbon organic carbon uh, low 0.5 and medium 0.5 to 0.75 and high uh, more than 0.75 nitrogen kg per x the uh, hectare alkaline para uh, alkaline per magnetic uh, low uh, less than 280 and 280 to 150 medium and the high is uh, 560 phosphorus kg per hectare uh, sodium bicarbonate sodium bicarbonate low is uh, less than 23 and uh, Twenty-three to fifty-six is medium, and high is of uh, fifty uh, more fifty-six. And potassium is a uh, ammonium acetate. Uh, low is a uh, one thirty, and uh, medium is a uh, one thirty to three hundred thirty-five, and uh, high is a three thirty-five, three hundred thirty-five. Uh, sulfur. Mm, heat soluble calcium chloride uh, low is uh, less 20 and the calcium is uh, 
cation exchange capacity percentage ammonium acetate uh, less uh, 125 magnesium also a percentage of a cation exchange capacity ammonium acetate uh, method extraction low less than 4 and zinc is uh, uh, adp method Uh, zinc is D A D D T P A method. D T P A low is a zero point six and zinc zero point six to one point two and more than one point two. Molybdenum also D D P A D T P A. Less than three point zero. And medium zero point six to one point two and high is one point two. Copper D uh, T P A ammonium acetate and zero point two medium zero point six and one point two and high is one point two. Iron D T P A zero two point five and five point five low. iron also ammonium acetate extraction method low 0.0 uh, 2.0 and boron hot water 0.5 low let let us sum up after soil testing nutrient supply map can be drawn uh, for a uh, for, uh, Forms uh, large region and countries. Such maps uh, provide a useful uh, generalized picture of soil fertility data. The extent to a which soil fertility map can be used for a planning nutrient management strategy. Uh, strategy. 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 strategy uh, strategy depends on how uh, tra uh, recent and representative the soil sampling does has been done macro level uh, maps are more useful as uh, an awareness and uh, educational tool rather than for determining of a nutrient application strategy hence soil testing is a must to obtain the economic yield from a crop plants so we have completed soil testing procedure and uh, information seeds and uh, what type of uh, analysis about the soil we can uh, do and uh, also about we uh, we discussed sampling tools precaution and collection and storage uh, of samples and depth of sampling soil sampling processes soil sampling processing and also we can discuss uh, different types of uh, uh, labeling of samples method drying and sieving of soil samples for analysis registration of samples in the laboratory So here completed. Next video we will discuss about uh, uh, nitrogen analysis method. Available nitrogen analysis method. So thank you.